the joy of celebration pervaded the house of Ibunedion as thousands of friends, family members and well-wishers converged on the house of Ibunedion to identify with their summer of Benin on the New Year celebration. Security arrangement was intact as over 200 security personnel mounted strategic positions to ensure a heat-free celebration. The legendary hospitality of the house of Ibunedion was extended to all the guests as the ceremony shifted to the Garden of Eden Wing of the House of Ibunedion, where a lavish reception held. Some of the guests commended the celebrant, the Esama of Benin, Sir Chief Dr. Gabriel Osaru Ibunedion, for his foresight in maintaining the culture of beginning the new year in the House of God. They prayed to God to grant the Esama many more years on earth to enable him continue to act as a rallying point for such a spiritual exercise. The guests described their summer as a godly man whose love for the gospel is legendary. It's traditional. It has become part of the environment. We pray that God blesses him, uh, that he should continue to grow from strength to strength. Uh, he's one of the most colorful people that we have uh, in this environment. And we pray that he will continue to bring joy and dignity to the people, just as God too will give him and his family joy and upliftment. He's a very unique man. In spite of the graces of God and the opportunities he has, he doesn't play with the issue of his work with God. And I see him growing on it every year. So we have come to join him, give thanks, and to also commit him, his family, and enterprise to the hands of our God. That's why we are here. My prayer to Esama has been is to, to live long and enjoy himself because he's a kind man. He has a good heart. He doesn't jealous people. He likes anything that is good. So, such man must last, must last and last long. I think it's a wonderful uh, this thing, and we thank God for the life of Fikbinadion. He's uh, somebody that all of us will feel proud of. We feel proud to identify with uh, him. Now that he has uh, given up uh, his life to Christ, that is an inspiration to very many of us, and we thank God for it. We are just praying to God that he should continue to guide and prosper him and his family. It's a yearly event. We want to thank God that every year there is increase. And uh, what gives me joy is that is if the Grenadians they are getting closer to God every year. That is the beauty of all of it. Yes, he's drawing closer to God. He's knowing God better and better every year. So we really want to thank God that the labor of the Christian in Lado State for the household of the Grenadians is not in vain. His Excellency Sir Gabriel Sawai Radio is fantastic. Can you mind the crowd? It's not easy to move out on the first day of the year from your house in the morning. It's not easy. Not everybody can do it, but very many people did it today. So with this crowd, I wish you the best good of luck. I wish you long life and prosperity. He'll be celebrating his 80th year today. We will all live to assist him, to join him, to celebrate it. Today is the first day of the year, and uh, we thank God for everything. And uh, we wish him long life and prosperity. Commenting on the celebration, the SMA described the morning due service as a tradition he has sustained for 40 years. What a glorious God to spare our lives. We have everything to thank God. This thing, I have started it over 40 years ago. I have never failed. When you start with the Lord at the first day of the year, the Lord will see you through. That's the address of my doing it. Matriarch of the House of Ibunedion, Lady Cherry Ibunedion, also played a key role in ensuring that guests were well taken care of. Over 300 religious ministers from various denominations, Knights of St. John, Palace Chiefs, Captains of Industry, members of the Diplomatic Corps, political bigwigs, 
Members of the Nigeria Army Officers' Wives Association, NAWA, were among dignitaries and groups that felicitated with their summer. At the time of this report, dignitaries from all walks of life were still trooping in in their large numbers to felicitate with their summer on the New Year Day. Okada Avenue and adjoining streets were busy as various exotic cars competed for space. Kingsley Uchebu reporting.